WWF star and uh, NHB star. Very proud to have you here. Thanks hey, for having me. Shoot Shambach. fighter, he's Again. Pan Craig, Again. He's, you name it, this guy's a UFC. champion. This guy can do anything. I, 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 I pretty much Grace. tampered at everything. So He's uh, even been in the movies. Yeah, he's he's done, done it all. He's done it all. Good to have you here, Ken. No, thanks for having me. And uh, so, so far, I've been sitting ringside, man. It's just pretty good fights. Absolutely. Yeah. Got yeah. my blood pumping, you know. He holds a record of 2-0 and in no hold barred competition. Standing six feet tall, weighing in at 220 pounds, please welcome to the cage, Quentin Rampage Jackson! I'm from Memphis, Tennessee, but I'm gonna stick to my game plan, what I normally do, you know, I'm, I'm kinda, like a, kinda like a little brawler, I like to go in there, and, you know, and do my thing, you know. I like, you know, I got a little uh, wrestling background, just go in there and do my thing and take, take it to him. We will see who the king of the cage is today. Well, this fight here, uh, don't blink. We got Marvin Eastman. Big puncher. Uh, not only is a big a big puncher, but um, he's, a, he's a great wrestler. And uh, we got Quentin Rampage Jackson, who's also a wrestler. This is his debut. Um, <laughs> you kind of wonder why he gets put in with a guy like this for his debut. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> it just doesn't seem fair. Here we go. That was a good right hand there. Just, just glazed him. Nice kick. Oh, oh! Jackson landing a right. Yeah, I think he's thinking. Twice. Oh, another right. Jackson. No, better... ja Jackson's the one with the socks. We're gonna have to distinguish between the two guys because they're both bald. They both got black. They both got shoes on. Yeah. But the one with the socks is uh, Rampage Jackson. Now he, uh, he's just he's surprising people, ain't he? The... Oh, don't turn yeah, your head. It, but you know, Eastman's landed a couple hard tie kicks. Um, there's another one. I think uh, I think they're gonna. Oh, now they go. They might go to the ground. Maybe not. Well, I think if these guys go to the ground, it's gonna be by accident. It looks like both of them are pretty well content to try to duke it out. Yeah, but I think what's uh, the the uh, guy with the socks on? Yeah, uh, that's he, Jackson. He's dropping his hands a bit, man. He's got to keep them he's up. Gonna he's gonna get clipped. A hard one. Well, you know his background is not strikes. He's a wrestler. He says. Yeah, I talked to Jackson earlier. He definitely wants to take it down. He wants to go down to the ground. He's well aware of Eastman's Muay Thai background. Well, he needs to make a commitment before he gets tired, because it makes it tougher to take him down when he gets tired. He doesn't have bad hands either, though. He throws pretty straight, uh, straight punches. This is uh, we, well, this is what we call a resting point. You lean against the fence and uh, yeah, it's the watch old your balance. Uh, call a little time out there. <laughs> Yeah, Eastman's gonna be really hard to take down. He's got 15 years of wrestling experience, so uh, <laughs> Ooh, Jackson, Jackson's gonna have to. Another good hook. Oh, there we go. Good right hook. Yeah, this is gonna. This one. This it one lo it looks good. like Jackson's wearing down just a little bit. He's a little flat-footed. Another tie kick. That's gonna take oh, those, a toll. Yeah, they. they, they, they oh, oh. You can't do that. You can't do that. Got to watch Slide. the elbow. Elbow. the elbow. I don't think I've ever seen that in No Holds Barred No, I, I think Larry, the referee, uh, was so shocked he didn't even get a chance to warn him. He wasn't sure what yeah, he was he trying to do. He, I don't think he knew where that one landed. No, I think he might be actually have a choke hold on he's him here. He's got a side choke, actually. Yeah. Uh, it's a, well, it's a, but it's, it's nothing there because he's got to, in order for him to get that choke, he's got to flatten him out. He's got to sink it in deeper. Now, knees are allowed in this position, unlike Pride. Right. Oh, there's a pick. You can pick him and take him. Oh, he could have thrown a kick. That was a kick. Yeah, he could have got him coming up. Yeah. You can't use an elbow. Come on. Larry warning him about that flying elbow. That was something out of Yeah, I've never Bruce seen Lee. that. No, that's something out of the movies, I think. Yeah, <laughs> if it lands. Yeah, see, that's this is where it's going to be a who's in better oh. shape because there's no starting those, to tire. Those leg kicks are. Those leg kicks take it out of you. Yeah. He's going to start limping on that leg, and then. He's uh, already limping. He's time left. really flat-footed. Yeah, but you know, it's, any of these guys could throw a punch and knock the other guy out because they're both sloppy right now. Dropping their hands, they're leading in with their head, they're not moving their head. Hey, I learned all that this year, man. Good man, good man. <laughs> he should go high with a kick, man. I mean, that gets there. Let go, Sands. I'll tell you what, I'm really impressed I think they're by both, Jackson. They're, they're both pretty tired. That's, that's, that's probably why he didn't shoot very many head kicks. He's, yeah. 
they're, they're, they're pretty windy. They blew a lot of steam out that first round. Yep. It's technique, though, Don. You know, I mean, yeah. you get tired and uh, you keep throwing no, like, low leg kicks. Just relax. Nice, just nice high kick. Nice relax your body and snap your punch and snap That's your good. kick. To the yeah. body. It's good. And even if you're tired, you can still throw one to the head it's or easy. you can still just punch. Yeah, you know, and that's that's where the, the experience body. comes he's in, you know. You know body. you can throw it. That's good, that's good. He's throwing enough down leg kicks where every time he throws, you watch his hands, they drop every time. Yeah. He set it up, he's got a, he he's just got a nice setup. Defense. You just yep. give it a little short little pump to the leg and go to the head and yep. it'd be a knockout. Yep. Remember the old classic Mark Coleman and Pete Williams? Leg kick, leg kick, they're on the ground, punch, punch, punch. Faked with a right hand punch. He, he uh, dropped his hands, came with the round kick, boom, right in the face. See Ooh. where he drops his hands? Yeah. See right there, boom, it's there. It's there. I gotta admit. Hey I guys, gotta, I'll be right back. I'm gonna go down this corner. Oh, I can't do that. Huh? Hey, <laughs> watch it now. Watch it like, now. Where are you going? <laughs> I'll say one thing. Neither one is going to the ground. They're not trying to take each other to the ground. It looks like they're both content. Oh, there oh. was. There was. All right. Uh, we owe Ken five bucks. There was. He called it. He called him on the side of the head. A little bit more to the right. He'd have been right smack in the face. Good night. Back on the shorts. Well, that was Ken, nice. Well, Ken definitely knows what he's talking about. Well, I mean, you could see it. Don said, Don, you don't, I mean, Don's done long enough to know that, you know, you, you set everything up off earlier in the round. If you find a tough opponent and you don't know much about him, you can set a lot of things up in the prior earlier rounds. And now sure. these are not rounds, but same thing. He, this guy's setting him up on a leg kick, leg kicks. He's throwing a couple right he hands. Set him up for the head kick. Boom, That's the man. whole purpose of it. Drop the hands, one shot, the big one, bang. He just missed it, though. He needs to get out of there because, uh, there you go. Now, right there, he should be coming with a kick. It looks like Jackson's wearing down now. They both are, though. They're both tired. Yeah. Great first round. But Jackson is limping on that left leg. He's hurt. That yeah, he's, left leg he just is, sat down. is hurt. And you know what? Sitting down is not a good idea because no. <laughs> it's hard to get back up. That's why tie boxers just stand up in the corners. Yep. Because yeah. when you sit down, you got to get back up. It's, you got to use the muscle yeah. of that thigh. If you sit down, you got to have somebody rubbing your legs out. You got to keep that blood circulating. If you don't, you just sit down. That blood just rushes. Well, you, you know what? Keep it moving. Well, that leg is going to hurt tomorrow morning. <laughs> and the next not, day. He thinks he's day. in pain right now. <laughs> well, but I'm it. saying tomorrow when you wake up, the that's blood what clots, it hurts. The blood clots set in. I'll yeah. tell you what, guys. I, I wouldn't be surprised if Jackson doesn't answer the bell. Yeah, well, that's 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 the point. When he sat down like he did, that means those He's legs hurt. are going out on him. His left leg is hurt. He's hanging in there, guys. Yep. He's hanging in there. He's tough. Right He'll be, you know, he's one of those kids that are gonna be back. You know, Quentin right? Rampage right, Jackson's up, got up, heart. He's got right, heart. Right. You can't have any more heart than Jackson right now. He's coming. He's coming. He's coming. And he's still got that leg out there, man. Yeah. <laughs> I'd, I'd be switching oh. it up about now. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh. He goes high again. He's Looks like Marvin's coming alive now. He's landed both high kicks. Oh, that one there was a little off balance. See, the thing is, uh, Jackson's a little taller than him. He's got a little, little height advantage. Yeah, but he's going. You see, he's hungry. You see him going after that leg? He knows it. Got a little short right hand in there. He knows it. He's got that leg hurt, and he knows it. Oh, come on. Oh, this guy is not going to go much longer if he keeps taking kicks like that. Impressive Muay Thai skills. I mean, Eastman's just coming no, at him with no an elbow. Doubt Eastman is dominating, but I'll tell you, Jackson's oh. showing a lot of heart. A lot of heart. No, oh, he needs a couple knees here, and it's over. Oh, couple, shit. Oh, there we go. Leg couple, kick. Yep. Leg kick. Oh. He's got heart, don't he? He's got he's heart. Jackson's got He's been knee to the head, knee to the body, kick, in the punch. He's tired. And he's going, man. And he's going. He's trying like to win that. this thing. He's not quitting. He can easily walk out of that ring. Nobody no. Nobody no. feel any. <laughs> this kid's definitely coming back, you know. He's got a good chance here. He keeps fighting hard like this, you know. In this fight, so you never know. Right, One right hand, so it's Turn done it like around. anything. Turn it around. Most fighters would be on their way home right now. Oh, yeah. They'd be in the locker room showering right now. But not Jackson. Oh, he's got a takedown. Oh, oh he turned it. This is where he's going to be in trouble. Oh, Marvin's got trouble. the mount. Punches will follow. He's in trouble now. Yeah, they may, they may call this if he gets punched. Yeah, Too many. Too many unanswered punches. Right. They know he can't get out of it. If he's uh, not, if, if he's not defending him himself, the, the ref will definitely step in. Well, you got to protect the fighter first of all. That's first and most important. And Larry is very good at that. This is a great referee for the sport. Yep. 
and he's got his hooks inside to keep him from uh, trying to turn him, but it also takes away his balance. If his arms are not out, he can roll him. He's got to keep his balance. It's hard, it's hard to land effective strikes with his legs great by like that from the mount. You really have to sit back. Uh, that's not true. If you watch the fight with uh, Atsuka and myself, you can still keep those hooks in and still throw short enough shots. Punches don't have to be big, rounded no, punches. They, they can don't. be short shots. Short chops. This is what I'm talking about right here. This yeah, but he can throw the hooks in and throw nice short shots and still do just as much damage without Maybe keeping more. flattened Maybe out. Maybe pulling back and going. Yeah, a lot of guys get the mistake that they got to get up, sit up like that and throw shots. I can throw the hooks in right now, flatten the guy out, and throw short punches about this th an inch, three, three inches shots just as hard as I can coming up and throwing them hard it's and the probably repetitive land a lot blows quicker. that will do it the repetitive blows will stun a guy daze him but uh you know obviously getting this kind of a punch if you can land it from here yeah you got a lot of distance to travel you know but if you can land it that's good but throwing it from here you know it's uh you got it they see it coming but you can still land it but I like the hooks in I like to walk the body I like to walk the body walk it up to the head you okay yeah lots of fingers but right now fingers. He, he's got everything he wants you know he can just Throw short, you know, nice short shots. Boom, 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 boom. And also, when you're sitting up, um, it also gives you the option to go to the arm bar from the mount yeah, as well. Yeah, but you can get rolled sitting up. When you got oh, the hooks oh, in, you oh, can't oh. get rolled. Oh, Jackson. Oh, yeah. First oh, oh, Jackson's coming Jackson's alive. Coming alive. Coming Jackson's alive. coming alive. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, Jackson's up. That wrestling background, he got out of it. He got up. He's got a heart. Boy, that's <laughs> That's a, this is good. That's an understatement. He's got, there's got a, oh, he's got right more than heart. Look at that. This kid is good. I love him already. Wow. We counted, love it. Wow. We were counting him out a minute ago. Look yeah, at I him. I love him. He turned it around. I love him. He made the crowd come alive. Heck yeah. You know, that's, you can't, you cannot get, you cannot put that in somebody. He's got to have it. No, you can't teach that. Nope. You cannot teach. Look at him, man. Yeah, great. Look at him. Look great. at him. Be, uh, man, that's, that's a hard Look right at there, that. Baby. Look at that. That's hard there. And he, the last 10 seconds, he was trying to win. Yep. Now he's going to pass out. Oh, that's all right. He can pass out now. That kid will be back. Yeah. You got to be good. You got to get back, man. He got good. I think the crowd is on their feet right there. Wow. Absolutely. Standing ovation. Great fight. Absolutely. The last 10 seconds, he gave it everything he had and collapsed on his back. Absolutely. That's what you want. Hey, that kid there, you give him another year, and he's going to be a champ, man. He's got it in him. Absolutely. Quentin Rampage Jackson. Remember that name. Ladies and gentlemen, after two rounds of pure action, the judges have made a unanimous decision for the winner, Martin Houston. Let's have a big hand for the very game of Martin, Mr. Quentin Jackson. Look at that, man. Incredible. Wow. Two good fighters right there, boys. Quentin Jackson is 22 years old. He's uh, just starting out. He's a baby. Quentin's listening. He's you just come see starting me, man. out. Come see me. <laughs> I'm here with Marvin Eastman, who just fought a phenomenal fight. A lot of great stand-up, really good tie boxing. You gave him a lot of punishing low kicks, a couple high kicks, but he kept coming back, and he made a comeback in the last round. Yeah. You know, hey, anybody in there fighting no holes, is going to come and fight hard, you know? Okay, I'm here with Quentin Jackson after a spectacular match. In losing, Quentin, you fought a great fight. Tell me what happened. Well, you know, I went in there and did my thing, and 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 dude, just a better guy. It was on my third fight. I just wanted experience, and that's what I got. I take nothing from that guy. He he's a good fighter. He gave me some good kicks to the head, and and I actually liked I liked because I'm getting experience. Well, you almost reversed him and almost got in control of the fight, almost took him out in that last few seconds of the round. Well, if I would have had a little bit more energy and trained more for the fight, I only took the fight in three weeks' notice. But if I would have trained hard and stuff like that, I'm not making excuses, but I want to I rematch him one day once I, train, once I train more. Okay, that was a spectacular effort in losing. Congratulations.